Today I'm going to be doing a review of the Jessam Clear Cut Stock Guides for a router table. The purchase was an impulse buy. I saw them sitting on a shelf in a woodcraft store and I figured I'd give it a try. I had already owned the Jessam Router Lift and have always been really impressed with the quality and workmanship that went to their products. After unpacking, it was evident that this too was a very high quality product. All parts were made out of metal and aluminum, with the exception of the plastic rollers. You get two clear-cut stock guides in the package. These do the job of four feather boards. This is a setup I've previously used. I had two in-feed feather boards, as well as two out-feed feather boards. The feather boards on the fence put a downward pressure on the board. The feather boards on the router table put a pressure pushing inwards to keep the wood against the fence. And finally, all the feather boards have a slight angle that helps to assist with kickback so that the wood cannot come in a backward direction. The Jessam Clear Cut Stock Guides claim to do all the same with just two guides. Let's see how it works. Assembly simple. Just put the bolt of the stock guide into the T-track on the router fence, slide down, and tighten the knurled knobs. Here's what the assembled guides look like on the router. These back knobs are tightened. The forward knob gets loosened and it allows the guide to move up and down. We place our stock under the roller, put some downward pressure, and then tighten the knob. The roller does an excellent job of stopping the stock from moving in an upward direction. The guides prevent kickback because the rollers will only turn in one direction. They allow the wood to be fed, but then they prevent kickback because the wheel will not turn the opposite direction. The stock guides also pull the wood into the fence. They do this because the wheels are cantered at a five degree angle, thus they pull the stock into the fence. I intentionally left the gap between the wood and the fence. As I advance the wood, you'll see it gets pulled right into the fence. I've made multiple cuts since purchasing these stock guides, and each and every time I found them to be superior to using feather boards. At $99 it might seem very pricey, but when you factor in the cost of four high quality feather boards, it's not really that bad at all. After an extended test period, I would highly recommend the Jessam Clear Cut Stock Guides for the router table. I would never go back to the old way of doing things. When you've got a router bit turning at a high speed, any product that keeps your hands a safe distance from the bit is a great addition to any wood shop. The Jessam Clear Cut Router Guides do what they're supposed to do, and they do it very well. Thanks for watching. Stay safe in the shop.